Last week, we warned the U.S. equity market could be on the verge of rolling over in the aftermath of a run of U.S. inflation data that pointed to less investor-friendly, higher-for-longer Fed monetary policy. The U.S. dollar had reacted accordingly, pushing higher across the board, all while stocks managed to initially shrug off the data. But on Friday, this reality seemed to finally penetrate the equity market, with U.S. stocks taking a hard hit. Adding insult to injury was discouraging Michigan sentiment and fallout from the auto strike. Meanwhile, the ECB has signaled an end to tightening, and traders are now pricing the same from the BOE later this week. And of course, the yen has been making fresh yearly lows against the U.S. dollar on this very clear monetary policy divergence theme. Interestingly enough, commodity currencies have held up better on account of rallying oil and gold prices. Looking ahead, key standouts on Monday's calendar come from an ECB Guindo speech, Canada housing starts and producer prices, U.S. NAHB housing, and an ECB Panetta speech. That's all for now.